what the true baptism is. Go ahead. The book of Acts chapter 2, starting at verse 33. Lamar, listen good. Therefore, being the right hand of God exalted. First of all, do you know what's happening in, in the chapter of Acts 2? Acts 2. So Acts 2, Acts 2, they're keeping the feast of Pentecost. This is literally the next feast after the Passover where Jesus Christ died. They're keeping this feast. And right now, what... But did not Christ himself get baptized in water? Yes or no? Yes, he did. So in order for you Wait, to be saved, we get, you got to go down in the water because no, Christ was the example. No, we're going we're gonna, to we're gonna talk about all that. You, we, don't, we don't have to rush. We just like to do one thing at a time. But we're going to talk about all that. Right? The Old Testament doesn't contradict the New Testament. We agree. Uh, uh, right now, what's happening is the P Pentecost service. They are have, keeping the Feast of Pentecost. And Peter, the apostle, is teaching Jews from everywhere about the sacrifice that Jesus Christ just did during the Passover that was just passed. So Jews are only people of color, in other words, right? No, we, it has nothing to do with the color of your skin. Because I thought, because if I'm not mistaken, um, the apostle did say that no God Jesus Christ himself did say that it's not you're not a Jew inwardly but outward not outwardly but inwardly yeah but so that that's Paul but it doesn't have anything to do with the conversation we having right your, now that's your, correct your phone and light is on but that's not it hasn't had nothing to do with what we're talking about right now Peter is giving the Jews from everywhere who don't know about Christ they're telling he's teaching them about Christ using the Old Testament he's going to the Psalms and, go, and going to the prophecies of David, where David is prophesying about Christ. Now start at verse 33. Bring it out. Now let's look at Acts chapter 2 and verse 33. Therefore, being by the right hand of God exalted, and having received of the Father the promise of the Holy Spirit, he hath shed forth this, which ye, no, which ye now see and hear. For David is not ascended into heaven, heavens, but he saith himself, the Lord said unto my Lord, sit thou on my right, right hand. hand. Until I make thy foes thy footstool. Stop. Now, Peter is teaching these Jews because they know the Old Testament. They know the Torah. They know the prophets. They know the Psalms. All that. He's using straight Psalms to teach Christ at Pentecost. These Jews don't know Christ. They weren't around in the area where Christ was teaching. They coming from all over. Now, the, the reason we know they didn't know Christ is because of this next verse. Read verse 37. Come verse 37. Now when they heard this When they heard Peter teaching this They were pricked in their heart They they were cut They they Damn So that's who Christ is A lot of the Jews that was even in the land with Christ Didn't believe in Christ They wanted to kill him They wanted to stone him They are pricked in their heart Now read And said unto Peter And to the rest of the apostles Men and brethren What shall we do? They asking Damn what we gotta do now Cause I understand what you're teaching I understand who this man was and I understand the sacrifice that he gave for us. Read. Then Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ. So according to this, how did Peter say that you're baptized? Where did he say anything about water? Read again. This is Acts 2 and 38 that we at right now. Read verse 37 again. Verse 37. Now when they heard this, they were pricked in their hearts. Now when they heard this, they were When they heard this, they was pricked in their heart. Meaning they, they was like, damn, we was wrong. We was messed up. We was wrong. This is who Christ is. Read. And said unto Peter, brethren, what shall we do? Now they ask him what we got to do now. We know the right way. We know who Christ is. We know the right way now. What do we got to do? Read. Then Peter said unto them, repent. Repent. This is how you be baptized. You repent. You hear the word and you repent. You change and you go to the right way, which is following Christ and keeping the commandments. Read. Repent and be baptized, every one of listen, you. Listen, listen, listen. In the name of Jesus Christ for the remission of sins. Uh huh. And you shall. Re hold on, hold on. Hold on. We're going to keep reading because it doesn't end at this one verse. Right. And, and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. And you receive the gift of the Holy Spirit when you. Wait, 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 wait. It's, it's, it's telling you right here. We can go to what Christ said, but it's telling you right here too. Read it again. Then Peter said unto them, Repent, repent, and be baptized, every one of you, in the name of Jesus Christ, uh -huh. for the remission of sins. Read, and you shall receive the gift of the Holy Spirit. And then that's how you receive the the gift of the Holy Spirit, because what? For the promise is unto you, and to your children, and to all that are far off, 
even as many as the Lord our God shall call. So this is telling you how you receive the Holy Spirit, a gift that's already promised to the Israelites and their children. You have to repent. Read. Verse 41. Hey, this is the point. This is key. Listen. Verse 41. Then they that gladly received his word were baptized. They didn't, it's, this whole account don't say nothing about no water. None, no, nothing in here says anything about water. I just want you to understand though, Right, they say you're not being baptized by water or baptized by water in sea. Yeah. It's, it's like it, real quick. It says, wait, 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 Oh, okay. <laughs> so verse 41. Yeah. This is why I know Jesus. Oh, this, so now you don't? Hold on. This Brother, is why. we don't want to argue. Y'all don't know Jesus. Oh, hold on. Relax. relax. We talking to him. That's, That's not on the Spirit. Relax. Relax. That's you not showing the fruits of the Spirit right now. Hey, hey so, so, definitely so this is why no, you wouldn't be convicted. Because you're not, you're not being long-suffering and patient, bro. bro. Relax. You being I'm rude. Being you being rude because we talking to one man and you cutting in with your own question. You're acting like Lamar don't deserve to hear the word. He, I'm agreeing with Lamar, actually. So then okay, let's, so, so, let's, 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 so listen. So this is why verse 41 is the point. It says, then they that gladly received his word were baptized. How did they How did they be, be baptized? By doing what? Following the same with Jesus. By receiving the word. Yeah, receiving it. Yeah. And, and Jesus said that. But That's this, the seed, though. But this don't, Jesus said that. This don't say well, nothing Jesus, about water. Hold on, wait, wait. I wasn't finished with my point. Jesus is the example that we must follow. Wait, listen, listen. I wasn't finished with my point. And it reads on, it says, In the same day there were added unto them about 3,000 souls. So it said 3,000 souls were baptized after they received and believed in the words that Peter was speaking. Now, Peter... At the, at the Feast of Pentecost... That's one night. Twelve disciples had time to dump 3,000 people in water? Yeah. Don't. No, no, stop playing. How they don't? Oh, bro, you know what I mean? 3,000 3, people yeah, that had... Mean, people want to be saved, they, they believe the message. They had the time to do this in one day? What makes you think they don't have the time? They had time to do this in one day and give the sermon... Yeah, You're telling me miracle, during man. the time of the Feast of Pentecost, he's not, Peter... He's he not even thinking like, let's about what let's, let's be realistic. Peter had time to... Read, read the verses above there. Let's see all the other things they did before them 3,000 people. Verse, oh, verse 39. Verse 39. For the promise is unto you and to your children and to all that are afar off, even as many as of the Lord our God shall call. Now let's see what else they did besides uh, baptize these 3,000 people in water. And with many other words did he testify and exhort. So after telling them about Christ through the Psalms, he also exhorted Christ some more. And what else? Saying, save yourselves from this untoward generation. Read. Then they that gladly received his word were baptized. Read. And the same day there were added unto them about 3,000 souls. Read what else they did. And they continued steadfastly in the apostles' That's doctrine actually. and fellowship. So after the 3,000 people was yes, dunked sir. in water, they still had more time in the same day to preach some more. And what else? And in breaking of bread. And they had time to eat and feast as well, read. And in prayers. And they had time to do prayers. Come All on, in, one, I, in one day, 3, bro. 3,000 people? They had time to baptize 3,000 people in one day, eat, preach some more, and, and give bread. bread and and come on, bro. Keeping a piece of so is God not their strength? Is what you're saying? Hold on, no. Yes that's no. not what that's I said. I'm asking you to just be realistic. Three three thousand people was not dumped in the, in water, and they had time to do all this in one day. So, so, so you neglecting the fact that you got to You can't. So in other words. Y'all saying that you don't have to be baptized and water in order to be saved. That, it's not. It's not. It's not necessary for salvation. Only thing that's necessary. Yes. Only thing that's necessary for salvation is for you to keep the commandments and believe in Christ. What? You believe in Christ, that means you got to believe what His apostles are preaching, though. His, show me where His apostles got baptized. Show me where John the Baptist himself was when John baptized. baptized Jesus. Where was John the Baptist himself Wait, when baptized? When he baptized Jesus, he told, he said, he before he baptized, he said, what? "Can you baptize me?" And, 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 did, and did Jesus baptize him? No. So, okay. John, so John the Baptist is not going to heaven, right? What you mean? John the Baptist is John the Baptist going to heaven? Yes, he is. How? He's in Christ, heaven now. He didn't get baptized. Hmm? He didn't get dunked in water. God, God chose him. Oh, so, so you're saying that 
you don't have to be baptized in water to be to get Please, salvation. No, no. John, the Baptist, about it. John the Baptist didn't get baptized. You can't show me that in the scriptures. Christ said no. Hey, can I preach? Wait, wait. No, all right, all right. wait, wait. Okay, okay. I want him to I want him to understand what we're saying. Did John the Baptist get can you read to me where John the Baptist was dunked in water? No, no right? right? But you still saying he going to heaven? Yeah, so you he was hand chosen by God. That contradiction. How? Because you, <laughs> you're saying that you have to. It's no if, ands, or buts yeah, about it. They preach you it. said yes, right? Yes, so John the Baptist is not going to heaven according to you. Right, God because chose he, him. You can't show me he where was he, a sinner where God found him. So you tell me. Show you me, show me where John the Baptist was a sinner. No, he wasn't a sinner. My bad. Show me where the apostle Paul got dunked in water. Can you show me where the apostle Paul got dunked in water? No. Is he going to heaven? Yes, he is. How? Because he was chosen by God. Man. So you don't have to be baptized yeah, in water. Christ is the no. example. In order for anybody to... No, I'm yeah, saying, though. Why was it John the Baptist dunked in water after Christ was dunked in water? John the Baptist. Because you don't have to be. It's not necessary for salvation. We're going to show you. We got, not we got many scriptures. We're not telling you that it's a sin for you to be baptized no, and dunked in water because could, Christ did it. If you want to go get baptized in water... Go ahead. Please do so. It's not a requirement for salvation. But you got to understand. This is all I'm saying. You got some people out here that are water ain't gonna save. milk. You can't feed people meat. Water ain't gonna save. You're preaching the word. So, what that has to do with No, I'm just saying. At the end of the day, not everybody is grasping what you're saying. It's not because they don't want to understand. That's why we stay out here so long. Take our time. You're right. Well, I know my pastor who I'm under, Pastor Gino Jenny. He's a true man of God. Wait, wait, wait. Let me let me ask you. He said the Israelites be lying. We seen the, we seen the clips. What was it? you not saved because of your black skin? Hey, slide down. And we don't even teach that. And he called it dirty. What was he did? We don't even teach that you saved because of your skin is black. We don't teach that. Israelites can in today's time can become any color. Y'all gonna find out that the Israelites know this book. Yes, sir. Right. What, what was Christ? What was Christ's baptism? That what did John identify as Christ's baptism? John, hey, hey, hey. In, in, no, in, no, John he got to go to work. He got in, to in, in the spirit and in fire. Yeah. That was Christ's no, baptism. Next time, so, next Saturday. I mean, I can't just ask you one question. Do you? Are you, know, you, do, do you, are you, are you gonna let him? Are you okay with him yeah. stepping in front of you for a second? What's up? What's up? What's your name? We want to answer I'm gonna your ask question. you a question first. What's your My name? name's Jimmy. Jimmy. Yep. What's your question, Jimmy? So, you don't believe that he baptized three thousand people? But you do believe they I fed. Be hold on, hold on. Let me ask you a question, brother. Okay, go ahead. So you asked me two questions. They, no, I'm, I'm asking. Ask right, go, well, ahead. I'm go ahead, go ahead, go ahead, Jimmy. So they fed 5,000 people, right? Yes. So you believe in that part of the Bible? Yes. So the, I believe being, in the, entire so the Bible. 12 disciples have been working with multiple numbers. So you don't believe that they can feed 5,000 with two fish and, and five breads and two fish and seven loaves. Multiple when, people, right? This, multiple people. When, when Christ was on the scene, he was performing miracles. But he After, had wait, his workers I understand do the question. job for him. Wait, we understand he your made question. the miracles happen. Wait, 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 the wait, the work. wait. You okay, now you got your mind made up, but we're going to still answer. So they can't. So when they Christ. Can't, Wait, 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 wait. When Christ was on the scene, they was performing miracles. Yes. That was the requirement for people to believe. Even after two. But when Christ left the scene, it became about faith. Right. So it's not like they have to perform yeah. a miracle of multiplying loaves again. But they did. Peter Does it say that? Miracles. And Peter that's my next question. And Jesus that's my ne and that's my next question. Did it say they performed a miracle to feed yes, those people? He, 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 he said the lame man. No, no, no. You didn't hear his question. question. You didn't did, hear his question. Does, does Acts 2 say he fed those people via miracle? Baptized them. Uh, uh, baptized them, fed them, and preached them no, via miracle. That part it didn't, but right. before Jesus left, so before Jesus left, that. he told Peter, feed my Christian. sheep. Hold on, hold on. We, hold on. we can only answer yes. one at a time. Right. And that's what he did. He was already anointed with the power, so they had the power See, this, of Jesus this is to what work you, through whatever they needed to work. This, 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 what you, this is what you got baptized. This is what you're missing. We don't we don't disagree that three thousand people. Wait, I'm you still can, I'm talking, bro. That's this is what I'm talking about. You rude. We don't dis we don't dis that's against what Jesus taught. He never said be rude. No, I'm speaking bold. No, you're being rude. Because if you if you come with a question, then you need to be quiet when somebody's answering. And do everything decently and in order. I didn't contradict anything. I never said that I don't believe that 3,000 people wasn't baptized on the day of Pentecost. I don't believe that they was dunked in water. 
they was baptized how the scriptures say they was baptized right. by receiving the word. And we can show and we can and we show did, you and we, that. And we read that in the same chapter. It says, Jesus and on receiving Jesus. the word, three thousand more people were baptized and joined to their ministry. It never says anything about anybody being dunked in water in this account. Not one time in the book of Acts chapter two. It don't say that. It says that they were baptized by repenting and receiving hey, the word. Can I read this now? You're wrong. This is 1 Corinthians. And then you're, and you're proud. This is 1 Corinthians 1 and 17. For Christ sent me not to baptize. And this is the apostle Paul. Who for, for Christ sent me not to baptize, but to preach the gospel. gospel. Right. This, is, this, gospel. This, is why, this is why I ask you not to baptize, but to preach the the gospel, right. yeah. John 15 and 3. Yeah. And, and what's the John. wait? I like that. What he said, Preaching the gospel is following the instructions of God. Yes. Right. Are the instructions of God that thou may not add to or take away from this right. life? That's Are you adding to the no? That's the revelation. That's Deuteronomy, that's Deuteronomy 4 and 2. Revelation 22. That's, Re that's Deuteronomy 4. Yeah. Are you adding to the law by saying, To be saved, you must be baptized? Yeah, you got to be baptized. So Wait, I didn't ask you that. Yeah, hold on. I didn't ask you that. I don't like that. When people ask me something, I got to answer, answer it. Question. Listen to the question first. The answer. Mm -hmm. You just said you must follow the law of God. Right. Did the law of God say, thou shalt not add to or take away from right. this law? Yeah. Did the law teach that you have to be baptized to be saved? No. no Are you adding that? No. Gotta be baptized. Are you adding that? No. The, law, the law doesn't so say that. So how do a person receive the Holy Ghost? I'm gonna show you. Because planting the word, that's the seed in a person. Incorrect. I'm gonna show oh. you. John 15, 3. It's the book of John chapter 15 and 3. No, it's not. Now you are clean. Wait, 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 wait. Listen. He's he's over here spitting his doctrine. He said the law was before <laughs> Jesus, and when Jesus came, the law was done away with. <laughs> Even though that Jesus himself said, "I did not come to destroy the law." Right. You, you, bugging you, you bugging out. You bugging. You bugging. You don't know what you're talking about. Hey, he listen, 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 listen. He has a zeal, but this not, not according, according to knowledge. To knowledge. Right. This, this is the book of John, 15 and three. Now you are clean. How we? What does it mean to be clean? Your sins are washed away. You're saved. If you believe and repent of your sins. Read this. Now you are clean through the word which I have spoken unto you. Right. The word is what cleans you. Right, right. What, right. What, yeah. That's I what clean. What right word did Christ teach? Like, for instance, y'all preaching the word, right? What word did Christ I can hear y'all preach and still not, walk by, but I heard you're not that listening to me. Clean, though. You what? I, me walking by. The Bible hearing, says no, be doors of the word, not no, just hearing. Right, 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 no, right, right. What I'm saying is, if you preach a word, a stranger walking by, and he hear you preach it, but he continues walking, that don't so, make him clean. He got to follow what the word is saying. And what is the word that Christ taught? In order to receive the Holy Ghost, you got to be baptized. Christ ain't say that. Christ said this. Christ said this. Christ said this. Go to Matthew 23 and 1. Hey, bro, bro, yes. 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 Read yes. this, Matthew 23 and 1. This is what Christ told. Con, this is the book of Matthew, chapter 23. Ruffle, bro. Are you good? Because oh. we're going to come straight out the scriptures. We're not going to. No, he don't. Right. That's right. No, he does not. Because if he's telling you that you have. Yo, yo, hey, yo. I, you kind of not listening to us, though. I used to be deep into this until, into I, what? until I found him and deep how he into preached what? the word. So you fell away. Yeah. It's not fell away. You, you, you know used to be deep into what? Slide down. Y'all gotta understand that you used to be deep into what? Everybody, we, we all believe in Jesus you used to Christ, be deep into what? Everybody's preaching Jesus Christ. You, you know, all have the same. You know what you're saying right now? You, you're saying Paul is wrong when he said, "I am not sent to baptize." You, you're correcting. He, he did come, but he, he did not come to baptize. The scripture said that he did not come to baptize. You came to preach the word. What does the word say? But I thought, I thought, if he came to preach the word and baptism is the way to salvation, then him he would have to come to preach. You gotta get baptized. Yeah. Why would he where, even say that then? Where, where the now you're contradicting. You are not. But what you're does like John say? What does John, what what does John say? say? If I'm not mistaken, I don't know word, word for word, but God did say if you're not baptized by water, you cannot see the kingdom of God. Then you're, you're mistaken. Right. Am I, how am I mistaken? Because I'm the explain. scripture don't say that. I'm going to explain. You're, you're mistaken. And we're going to explain. You're mistaken because the scriptures don't say what you just said. Give me, uh, get, what did I ask for? Matthew 23 and 1. This is what Jesus taught. It's the book of Matthew. 
Matthew 23 and 1. Listen good. Then Jesus spake to the multitude. To and, all them people. And to his disciples. And told his disciples. Saying the scribes and the Pharisees sit in Moses' seat. The scribes and the Pharisees sit in Moses' seat. What that mean? The scribes' job now is to teach you the law of Moses. The Pharisees' job now is to teach you the law of Moses. Right? Read. All therefore, whatsoever they bid you, observe. That observe and do. What that mean? Everything that the scribes and Pharisees tell you to do from the law, that observe, observe and do. Is Jesus Christ telling you to keep the law? Yes. Does the law say do not add to it? No. Yes, yes it, it says do not add to it, but was not the phrases add into it? Yes or no? Was, was, they, what? was not they was adding to it? No. They was not no. adding to it? No, you can't. You they can't. didn't follow it. They was hypocrites. They was teaching people to do it and wasn't doing it themselves. That's evil. What does Matthew, I think it's that. Wait, we're not leaving this. So Jesus Christ also died on the cross. I'm supposed to do that? Carry your cross, yes. Am I supposed to go die right now? Because Christ died. Jesus Christ, No. Bro, so why are you still alive right now? No. See, you never taught, you never he asked these questions. Did. Nobody never Nobody asked you this. Nobody asked you none of this. Read this, read this, read this. Come on, bro. Come on, you, you heard what he said? It's not my time. Jesus Christ fasted 40 days and 40 nights. You, you gotta go do it? You did that? No, I, I, I don't even think I could right now. Okay, so now you can't make it. You gotta fast. But you can't make it, though, because you didn't do 40 days and 40 nights. You don't have to exactly do 40 days. Okay, then. You don't have to exactly bro, do everything. You're a hypocrite. Okay. <laughs> You're a hypocrite. What's yeah. the meaning of fasting? Bro, you're being hypocritical. What's the meaning of fasting? To deny yourself. Of what? Of food and water. But what's the reason for it, though? Okay. It depends. Which, what you mean? Depends? To deny it depends. Wait, look. They, they, some people fast because they feel like they want God to do something for them. Some, yeah. people, some fast because they're in mourning. Some people fast because they're in mourning. Uh, like Judah. Some people fast because they feel like things aren't going their way and they want the Most High to change right. that. Right. Fasting is giving up something to get closer to God. No, we're not. We're, Wait, let me, the thing is, we're not saying going into that, that Ash Wednesday do thing. Y'all do you're Ash saying, Wednesday? It's my bad. My bad. You're, you're saying you have to do exactly what Christ do. And yeah. we're showing you you don't. You can fast, but are you fasting 40 days and 40 nights? No. Okay, that doesn't mean that you're sinning, that. though. You're not sinning, though, if you don't do that, right? Okay. Okay, then. That's what we're teaching. We're, now, we're, now, listen. Let, let this come out. Bro, Explain if you, this. If you fast 40 days and 40 nights right now, bro. you're going to die. Hey, yo, Lamar. <laughs> Lamar. <laughs> so why you ain't do it? <laughs> yo, I don't have, yo. I don't have <laughs> Lamar has already confessed can't give the strong meat. Right. Let's make it simple for him. Read this. You can't go with that this food is that Luke long. 10 and 26. Where's the lot? This is book 25. The, Luke chapter 10 and 25. And behold, a certain lawyer stood up and tempted him, saying, Master, what shall I do to inherit the eternal life? Somebody asked Jesus, what shall I do to right. inherit eternal life? And, and, what is Christ as? I'm my fault. I, I, I'm so eaten up. Guys. And this person is called a lawyer. When you go into the Greek, this man knows the law of God, the Torah, like the back of his hand. Yeah, but he came up to him by night. Right? No, that's not, no, that's Nicodemus. That's Nicodemus. Yeah, this is John 3. Hey, bro, you got to study with us, man. We're going to show you some things. Yeah. He said unto him, what this is, is Christ, Christ's answer to the lawyer? Read. What is written in the law? The first thing he said is what's written in the law. So that means you got to do what to find the answer to get eternal life? Yes. You got to study the law. And when you study the law, do you find anything? That it's says you must be you must be dunked in water. Thou shalt be baptized, immersed in water. You don't say it just like that, but you do got to be baptized by water in order to you, receive. And, it's, and it, says order that, to receive it says that in the law. And what, and does what it law? say that? Does it say that in the law? What you mean? Does it say that so you? Is the New Testament not the law? No. no. If, what, what's different about the New Testament? The New the Testament is people talking about, about the, the law. law. Right, and Christ came and did everything the law said, right or wrong. Yes. yes. So, so him getting dumped in water, you got to get dumped so in show water. Me that in the show me that in the law. Show me that in the law. That's what we should be. That's what show we're me saying. that in the law. So that's show us that. How is that Look what, look what Christ said to get eternal life. He understand. He understand. Why did he say you got to be dumped in water to get eternal life? What did What did Christ tell the old man when he said, when the old man said, can I enter a, a woman for a second time? But he go and find that verse. That's Nicodemus, bro. This is a bro, different just account. Go to, 
after this, let's go to John 3. But you act like different accounts contradict the other accounts that you don't You are making it. them contradict. You don't understand it. Because gonna, you're teaching the account the wrong way. We're going to show you. The I'm account of Nicodemus has nothing yeah, to do with John baptism. John 3 is the account. Yeah. I'm saying, it has nothing to do with baptism. Man, Jesus, the old man. That's Nicodemus. I'm saying, though, bro, well, what did he I'm tell him, though? Again. You must be born again. How? We're going to show you. We're going to show you. We're going to show you. But first, learn this. They have nothing to do with baptism. Because the Bible, I got See, what y'all reading is not in the same Bible. Yeah. Yes, sir. Do, do you read it? What the hell? Well, you, don't read this, you don't read this type of Bible? That's the King James. So what you talking about? We reading the same Bible? That's reading King James. In, well, from what I read, I don't read it every night, but when I read, it seems like y'all not saying the same exact word. We're not saying the same thing that Gino, Gino is saying, you. but we saying exactly what's in this book. We reading it for you. Slide you can't, down. You can't, keep saying it? you can't tell us, you can't say that right now, since you've been talking to us, that we said something that's not been written. Wait, wait, that, that doesn't mean nothing. That don't mean, I don't give a that doesn't mean that. anything. I don't, I don't because because Christ that. himself said that the path to heaven is, is Narrow, right. not why. So we people trying to assassinate him. You tell me he's so? preaching the wrong doctrine. Yes. And yes. people trying to assassinate him. Yes. And I'll prove to you why they trying to assassinate him. Niggas Go assassinated to John F. Chapter Kennedy. Five. And he a devil. They assassinated Lincoln. He a devil. <laughs> Who the hell cares? Look, I'm about to cut him real quick. So they did you Martin said Martin King too. That him trying to. They assassinated Abba Bivens, who is the origin of our style of instruction. They assassinated him. A bunch of Muslims killed him in Newark, New Jersey. So now are the Israelites automatically right? Cause, cause he actually got assassinated. Come on, bro. You gotta so think, think about, about this. So y'all believe in the voices of man? Man with long hair. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Watch this. Watch this. Read this. Hold on. One thing at a time. Acts chapter five. These are not bad questions. One thing at a time. So, oh, Samuel right is assassin. He a Muslim. That make him right. Right here. This is Acts five and thirty four. Now, but when we read this, this is the the background of, of this is the apostles teaching Jesus Christ in Jerusalem, and the high priests and the Pharisees want them to stop doing that. They want him, they want the apostles to stop teaching Jesus Christ. They want him to stop teaching Jesus Christ, and they're bringing them to council, saying that we need to kill them. Because they continue to cheat, teach Jesus Christ. Watch this, read this. This is the book of Acts 5 and 34. Then stood there up one of the council, a Pharisee named Gamaliel. Do you know who Gamaliel is? This is Paul's teacher. Read. A doctor of the law. He had, uh, had a reputation among all the people and commanded to put the apostles forth a little space and said unto them, ye men of Israel, take heed to yourselves what ye intend to do as touching these men. Because they want to kill the apostles for teaching right, Jesus right. Christ. Read. For before these days arose up Thaddeus, posting himself to be somebody, to whom a number of men, about 400, joined themselves. That's what Geno Genesis is doing. And that's what you're doing for Geno Genesis. you boasting out all his status and all the people that's following him, how many people he baptizing, all his churches here and here, here and there. You tell a person about a fruit, okay, not cool. by a person yeah, standing okay, out because the devil watch, knows watch, more about the word than watch, we do. Watch, that has watch. nothing to do with what we're talking about. You just, you just quote, you just saying stuff, bro. Just that, saying, it's not related. Just Listen, read. Most of himself to be somebody to whom a number of men, about 400, joined themselves. That's what you just did. Who was slain. And all as many as obeyed him were scattered and brought to naught. Read. After this, a man rose up, Judas. Another one. A Galilee in the days of the taxi and drew away much people after him. Did the same thing. He also perished. And all, even as many as obeyed him, were dispersed. Now let's see what the point of, of Gamaliel saying this was. And now I say unto you, refrain from these men and let them alone. For if this counsel or this work be of men, it will come to naught. So just because people want to kill Geno Genesis don't mean that we're supposed to be going to follow him. That's not a reason That's to follow him. That's not a reason to follow him. But you brought that but up. You brought like it up. up. That was like the you, point that you was if making. you out here preaching the word of God, how the Bible says you should be preaching it, speaking against sin, you're going to have enemies. What is sin? Sin is transgression of the law. Does the law say thou shalt be baptized in water? No. You're supposed to follow what Jesus said. No. Is he not listening? He, he doesn't want to deal with that. No. So answer it. Jesus would have commanded you to answer that. He no. said, let your yay be yay. Your yay be yay. Does the law say, thou shalt be dumped in water? 
Oh, it doesn't say that, right? It doesn't you know. say anything related well, to that, right? Christ, wait, wait, Jesus wait, Christ wait, saying wait, you gotta be wait, baptized wait, in water. Wait, he he didn't say that. Never said wait, that. Wait, wait. Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. This is the book of Ecclesiastes. Bring it out. 12 and 13. The book of Ecclesiastes. Chapter 12 and verse 13. Y'all gonna read together. That sounds Let good. us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. What is it? What is the conclusion of the whole matter? What's that mean? Like the whole point. Sum it all up. Fear God and keep, keep his, his commandments. commandments. For this is the whole duty of man. Ain't that the only thing we supposed to do? Right. If I do that, read. For God shall bring every work into judgment. God's gonna judge me on keeping what? The commandments. Does God's law say thou shalt be dunked in the water? No, it does not say word for word what you just said. No, does it say anything like that? Does it say you must be baptized by water? No. no. How do you receive the Holy Ghost? Does it say you by, shall be baptized by, by water? If we Acts, say, Acts, Acts 2 and 41 said that the people who ended up receiving the Holy Spirit. First make him confess. Yeah, he he has, he's, not, he's, he's if it, resisting the Holy Spirit. If it don't say right that, now. what does it say? As far as what? Uh, uh, as far as ba water baptism. Does it say oh, anything like that? We're not no, talking, we're talking about the law. We're talking about the law. Did John follow the law? John, yes, he did. So that's what we're talking about. Right. Does the law say anything like that? Not word for word. What you're saying? I'm saying no. anything like that. But, so what John says? Bro, is wait. We're gonna, gonna, don't we're ask. Gonna, we're gonna answer that. But does the law say anything like that? No, not word right. for word. What you said? Or no. Does all. it say anything <laughs> like it? I'm answering your question. Don't no, say not. word for word. No. Does it say anything no. like it? No. No. Okay. Does no. the law say do not add to this law? Right. Yeah. Don't do that. Are you adding to the law? You just said it didn't say it. Just said the law. Let's, let's do this like this. Let's do this. We need the white boy. Who's this? Who's this? Oh, yeah. I'm I'm Thank you, brother. He's not baptized just, by water. just read it. Read it again. Just, Luke, Luke 10 and 25. Okay. He's ready now. He's ready now. Get, ready get now. the other one. Matt, See, you got to tear down them. The, you got to strip away. That's, he don't know. He, he never heard this before. This is the book of Matthew. Chapter I'm 9. I'm not mad at you. Don't it's, give him that loop, man. It's okay. the same account. Okay. It's the book of Matthew chapter 19 and verse 16. <laughs> it reads, And behold, one came and said unto him, Good master. Slow down and read God. and pronounce. God. It's the book of Matthew 19 and 16. Thank you. And behold, one came and said unto him, Good master, what good things should I do that I may inherit eternal life? Okay, now, is, is, he, is, is Jesus Christ about to answer him, answer him and say, must be submerged in water to receive no. the Holy Spirit and salvation. No. Is that what you no. about to say? No. no. So why didn't why didn't he say that? If that's how I'm supposed to get salvation, in order to be baptized, because when we when we come through a woman, when a baby is born, we got a natural sin, which is the flesh. No, the that's not true. Nah, what you mean? We are born into sin, are we not? Yes, so no. if a baby that just came out no, of his mother. Saying, are we not born into? Sin? Do you believe no. that baptism removes original sin? Yeah, it cleans you from all your what is the sin. what is the punishment of original sin? What you mean original sin? Because of original sin, what happens to man? The water can't take the sin. He probably doesn't water. believe that. He, he doesn't he doesn't believe in that doctrine. From my understanding, if I'm not trying to off track. If he know. said the word original sin, he teaches the doctrine. I don't, I don't think he's I'm saying he did. The reason why, to sum it up from Genesis, Adam I'm and Eve got kicked easy. out. That's I'm what asking. sin entered I'm, I'm into. Asking. The human race, yes or no? I'm asking. Yes or no? This Bro, you, just, you go into something no, else. I'm saying this not sin. The sin itself did not I'm, enter with Adam and Eve. I'm asking an easy no. question, Lamar. Mm -hmm. What is the punishment of original sin? What happens to man because of original sin? He sin. what? He what? He goes to hell. He dies. He dies. Yes. Sin brings forth death. He dies. Right. Do people that get baptized still die? Yeah. Yes, they do. So how did being baptized wash away original sin? They don't. Being baptized cleans you from your former sin. He didn't answer my question. How does being baptized cleanse because you you're from a new creation? It says that. Do you, but you still die. You just taught yeah. that baptism removes original sin. Hey, just because it removes sin doesn't mean you're gonna live forever. But you, but you said you're original not, sin. This, the flesh gotta die because flesh cannot inherit heaven. You're not answering me. You said mm -hmm. original sin. Mm -hmm. yeah. The doctrine of original sin. It's not in the Bible. The doctrine of original sin means because of that we die. Inheriting Adam's sin is why we don't live forever. Right? That's when sin entered. No, yes, because of that, that's when Wait, the sin no brought way. forth death. Oh, no, yes. Yes, no. <sighs> when Adam Are you listening sins, to yes, yourself? When Adam and <sighs> sins, that's when sin entered. Which into brought the in what? Damn. So then when I get baptized, that's off me, right? 
No. No, yo, you still gonna die when God choose to call you. So there's dead. no such doctrine as original sin. That's what you just learned. If you're gonna be on the word, that's probably a poor choice of word I chose, but just to stick on the word original sin and try to. You know, there's no concept. such thing as that. There's no is such it, thing as that. Is it, so let's forget original sin. Is it possible after I get baptized for me to sin again? Yeah. Yes. So but what's the what's the purpose of me this, being baptized? It don't People do, that are it not don't baptized. Mean so I can so so it if, don't if, if I don't if I himself. don't get baptized Yo, in water, I can't see the I can't heaven. repent. You're not gonna see the kingdom of heaven. What scripture say that? It don't mean. What scripture says that? Stay over there. What scripture say that? Okay, let's go to John. All right, then. All right, then. Let's go to John three because that's what you're going to stop. Malachi, do not slide down. You're pushing me into these women. It's this guy again. That's original sin. It's the it's the death that entered into the world. It's the destruction of our. Think he got the Holy Ghost just enough. That's the sin right there. No. No. Holy Spirit is the <laughs> Holy Spirit is the inclination to keep the commandments. Because in the, give me that in the uh, in the in the, in the wilderness they resisted the Holy Spirit. That's sin right there. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. No, no. That's the <laughs> take away the word. <laughs> yeah. Matthew, we're gonna get John Matthew, chapter three. Yo, you're doing right. look, look where y'all got I haven't moved yet. I haven't even moved. <laughs> I'm trying to get off. I'm trying to get all four of y'all yeah. in, 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 in the uh, camera. I'm trying to get for all, all four of y'all in the camera. Oh, can I have you shift this way? Okay. Yeah, we just all we just all four of them in the camera. Yeah. All just I might have to go back there way. like you, man. Yeah. And then, oh no, I'm gonna turn my phone like you. We just read Matthew chapter 19. That's it. That's it. That you have to kind of turn around. Okay. You come right here. My hand. Matthew did it. I got it right. Matthew 28 and 19. That has nothing. That says baptized by the Father. That says nothing about water. Who's the Father? Who's the Son? Who's the Holy Ghost? What is their name? The name of the Father right. is Yahweh. The name of the Son one, is Yahweh Shai. The, the Holy Spirit one, is not man. given a name. You better not do that to that What's one? the name of the Holy Spirit? So is Jesus Christ not God, yes or no? No, he's not the Father. What did that have to do with how, how, can you, how can Jesus Christ be the Father if I have to get baptized in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit? How is he all three? You act like it's a trinity. It's not there a trinity. is no trinity. Exactly. There's only one God and Jesus Christ is the one God. No, Jesus Christ is not the Father. Jesus Christ is not the Father. But what do that have to do with, with baptism? What that got to do with baptism? So do you you don't believe that Jesus Christ is God? No, he's not the Father, no. The, the Father is the Father. That's why he's called the Most High. And Christ is the Son. That's why he's called the Son. So in the beginning, and just said in the beginning was the Word. The Word was with God and the Word was God. Jesus Christ came, God came down in the Spirit and had in the flesh, in the flesh, through Mary, the Spirit that was inside Yo, the flesh was While we on the Trinity, we still dealing with this baptism. That's what he went to. Read that. Because if y'all going to preach in the Word, uh, Acts chapter 9. We do, but you don't have to be dumped in water. No. The scriptures don't say that. Then the second thing you said wrong is Jesus Christ is not God. He's not, he's not the Father. Oh, oh, You're wrong by saying that. You've actually blasted Wait, you say Jesus is the Father? Jesus Christ is God. No, Jesus is the Father? I'm saying Jesus Christ is God. Is There's he only the, is, one God. No, is, you ask is, him God. is Jesus he's Christ the Father? You want to say. He no, because you're trying to rephrase the no, question. No, I'm not. I'm asking, asking you a question. Is Jesus Christ the God? Is Jesus Christ the Father? Christ of God. I'm not asking is the, you that. Is the Father the Most High God? See, Jesus ain't a part of that. Is the Father the Most High God? that was in, and Jesus Christ. I didn't even ask God. about Jesus. Is the Father the Most High God? Jehovah. Is that the Most High God? Which is Jesus Christ. Yes. Jesus Christ is Jehovah. Yes. Now we can do now it. You, now, now we can correct You actually him. just committed the. Uh, now you just lied. You, and you I sinned. Lied. Because and you, you sinned. You made Christ into God. I have, Christ is God. I have a question. No, he's not. No, he's not. I have a question. Hold on, Elder. Hold on, Elder. Give me uh, read this. Read this. This is book of Acts, chapter seven, and verse fifty-four. Read it out. So like in verse fifty-one. We still dealing with this baptism. He can't get away. The book of Acts, chapter. He just said we still wrong for not teaching it. He's gonna stand corrected again. Book of Acts, chapter seven, and verse fifty-one. Ye stiff-necked and uncircumcised in heart and ears, ye do always resist the Holy Spirit, as your forefathers did. So do ye. The forefathers was in the wilderness, right? Was they commanded to get baptized? In the Old Testament. Yeah. Yeah. It was about awful faith. 
I didn't ask was, that. I said, was they commanded were they, were to they, get baptized? Were they, were they, were I don't Christ. like Gino's church. Were they were you Christ. ask him, son, he don't answer you. In the Old Testament, in the Old Testament. Why was they saved in the Old Testament? I'm asking faith. you a question. They were saved by faith. No, they, no, they were not. They were saved by keeping the commandments. Bro, if you didn't, you died. I'm going to stop I'm gonna stop debating you. It's obvious you don't know what you talking. know and what you don't. I'm good. But you're not comfortable yeah. answering any Answering. Question. Like, when you don't know something, you're not comfortable. And you say whatever. And you say whatever. And that's our fault. It's almost like we're making you say that stuff. And I don't want to do that to you. In the Old Testament, they resisted the Holy Spirit. Why? Because they didn't want to keep the law. You said you have to be baptized to get the Holy Spirit. Paul said they didn't get the Holy Spirit by not keeping the law. You say the only way to get the Holy Spirit is to be baptized. Right. Paul Repent says, Paul baptized. says yeah. to get the Holy Spirit, you have to keep the commandments. Right. You say to get the Holy Spirit, you have to be baptized. Paul says to get the Holy Spirit, saying, you have to keep the commandments. Saying, don't, don't you say, what, you, what the you, you, you are contradicting. How? Here's how. Here's how. You've been taught the idea that water baptism, like the action of being dunked in that water, gives you the Holy Spirit. Right? But you just I've seen a cracked fiend on video get baptized, jump out the water, and spark up a glass too. Yes. Do you believe he paid for your sins on the cross at Calvary? Yes. The Bible teaches that he shed his blood and that he put his blood on the mercy seat. Do you believe that? Yes, I do. The Bible says if you truly repent, if you truly turn to him, if you truly ask him to save you, he'll save you. That's what the Bible says. Do you look at me? Do you believe the Bible? Would you right now pray and ask Christ to save you? Yes, I will. Knowing that you're a sinner and that Jesus Christ, God Almighty, died for your sins. Would you right now pray? Just look at me. Yes, sir. Say, dear Lord. Dear Lord. I know that I'm a sinner. I know that I'm a sinner. And I know. And I know. That Jesus Christ. That Jesus Christ. Died for my sins. Died for my sins. And I come to him. And I come to him. And I repent. And I repent. And I turn to him. And I turn to him. And I ask him. And I ask him. To forgive me of all my sins. To forgive me of all my sins. Dear Jesus. Dear Jesus. Come to my heart. Come to my heart. And save my soul. And save my soul. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Let's give the Lord a hand. Amen. Now I'm going to question you. Michael. Michael. Oh, I want you to hold my hand here. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Baptize you, my brother, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Ghost. Blame, blame, blame. Amen. 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 Call your family. Call your friends. It's time to play the game. The truth of Yah. Learning the Bible has never been more engaging. The game does guarantee to increase your biblical knowledge, renew minds, and save lives. Grab your Bible and don't forget your Apocrypha. Loads of fun for everyone. The truth of Yah board game helps build up the poor in spirit. Build character. Gain wisdom. Show what you know or find out what you didn't know. Gain confidence. Line upon line, precept upon precept, make the truth of y'all a part of your home today. Come on, what are you waiting for? Join the fun today.